Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are discussing about how Pradhan Mantri Ujjwala Yojana is helping improve the condition of women in rural areas and fighting black carbon. India's commitment to climate action was made clear at the COP26 climate negotiations in Glasgow in November 2021 where it vowed to reach net zero emissions by 2070. This ambitious aim positions India as a leader in the global battle to carbon neutrality. As part of its efforts, India has achieved substantial progress in renewable energy, with over 180 gigawatt of installed capacity by 2023, putting it on track to meet its objective of 500 gigawatt by 2030, according to the Ministry of New and Renewable Energy. Black carbon, often known as soot, is a strong pollutant produced by incomplete combustion of biomass and fossil fuels. It poses substantial environmental and health dangers. Thus, it is critical to understand and limit its consequences. In India, the residential sector is the major source of black carbon emissions, accounting for 47%, followed by industries, 22%, and diesel cars, 17%. Traditional cook stoves that burn biomass fuels such as cow dung and straw are significant sources of black carbon emissions in rural regions. Other sources include industrial processes, diesel cars, and open burning. The environmental and health consequences of black carbon are significant, contributing to global warming by absorbing sunlight and creating substantial health hazards, such as cardiovascular disease, birth problems, and premature death. The Pradhan Mantri Ujjwala Yojana, PMUY, which began in May 2016, intends to provide free LPG connections to homes living below the poverty line. As of January 2024, over 10 crore households had received connections resulting in a significant reduction in black carbon emissions by encouraging the use of LPG as a cooking fuel. PMUI has emerged as a significant component of India's attempts to minimize black carbon emissions and switch to cleaner cooking fuels. By providing clean cooking fuel alternatives to traditional biomass, the program aims to improve health outcomes, minimize environmental pollution, and improve the quality of life for rural and economically disadvantaged communities. Despite its successes, PMUY faces obstacles such as low refill rates and price, especially in remote rural areas. Addressing these difficulties demands novel solutions, such as improving last-mile connectivity in LPG distribution networks and investigating alternate fuel generation technologies, such as coal bed methane, CBM, gas. In addition to PMUY, the government has adopted a number of legislative initiatives to promote clean cooking fuels and minimize black carbon emissions. These include LPG cylinder subsidies, raising awareness about the health and environmental benefits of clean cooking, and investing in infrastructure for LPG distribution and accessibility. India's attempts to reduce black carbon emissions are not only confined to local activities, but also include international cooperation and pledges. By aligning with global climate targets and engaging in initiatives such as COP26, India demonstrates its commitment to combating black carbon pollution globally. To put it simply, black carbon emissions represent major environmental and health dangers, especially in countries like India, where traditional biomass fuels are commonly utilized for cooking. PMUI initiatives help to switch to cleaner cooking fuels and reduce black carbon emissions. However, resolving issues such as price, accessibility, and last-mile connectivity would necessitate collaborative efforts from the government, communities, and other stakeholders. India can make substantial progress toward achieving its sustainable development goals by implementing comprehensive policies, encouraging innovation and cultivating international cooperation. That's all for today. Stay tuned for more updates. Thanks for joining us.